In today's video, I'm going to be breaking down a very simple man beater that you can utilize out of the U-Trips formation to be able to kind of beat some of the main blitzes and main defenses that you're going to be seeing online. Now, I actually just released a brand new U-Trips offensive ebook. If you want to get access to that, make sure that you join my Patreon. It's only $10 to sign up for the Patreon, and it gets you access to all of my Madden 23 offensive and defensive ebooks, as well as any updates to those ebooks while your membership is active. Like I said, it's only $10 uh, to to sign up for that and the U trips ebook is already out uh, and so I wanted to give you just kind of a quick little man play or a play that I like to use uh, for man to man coverage out of the play curl flat out of the New England Patriots playbook now uh, real quick one of the things that you're going to see if you are playing Madden 23 much is you're probably going to see this defense right here this is the dollar three two six and it's basically this right here now, what we're going to be able to do with the play curl flat is, let's say, for example, that they're base aligned and pressed uh, out of a man-to-man -man coverage shell. If we were to motion across one of these two receivers, we'll do Williams in this example, and then we're going to put... Um, Everett on and out, and we're going to slant Palmer, and then we can honestly just block our running back. It doesn't really matter. Um, you're going to see see how they don't follow him, and then I can motion him all the way out here, and if they're not careful, they can actually kind of create a automatic busted coverage out of any kind of cover zero blitz. Let me just show you. Let me grab Spinner real quick so that I can actually show you the idea here. So, again, I'm going to come out in the play Spinner. We're going to be base aligned right off of the rip here. And we're going to go to the play Curl Flat, which is the default quick pass audible in this formation as well. So, again, this is what the play art looks like. Almost always they're going to use her this defender here, and then they're going to man that guy up on the tight end. Again, whenever I motion this guy across here, you're going to see that the defenders don't follow him all the way across the formation. And so now you can kind of get these coverage busts where, you know, if they're not careful, you can have this slant um, or this, this fade, but you can also have this little quick route right here to the flat that is really effective for beating some of these heavy, heavy pressures that we're getting right now. The beauty of curl flat is that it uh, comes with a couple stock routes that are super, super effective. Now, again, one of the things that you're going to see is, you know, again, like I said, if they're not careful, they will bust these coverages. These coverages will certainly bust this year. I'm just telling you from experience, if you snap this guy kind of right in here, sometimes it can create some, some issues for them. And basically, they're going to think that the running back is covered, but he's not going to be covered. And then when they start to try to over adjust and to fix that, this is just going to create a lot of problems for them. So the beauty of this is this is quick reads that you can call that beat the blitz pretty consistently, right? Um, another thing that you're going to be able to do with this little play here is you have quick hitting routes everywhere. So if they run out to go defend that route, you can throw this out route to um, to Everett. So to try to illustrate this as best as I can, um, I'm going to try to kind of fix, quote unquote, the man coverage before I motion so that you can kind of see what it would really look like here. You know, but again, you're going to get something like this. Obviously, they're sending heavy pressure, right? We don't want to we don't want to miss that. But this quick out to the outside, if you put short and elite on that tight end, um, even without short and elite, he's going to typically get pretty decent separation for you. And again, I'll show it one more time, and then we'll cover some of the other stuff. But these are kind of your quick hitting reads where they're going to have to drop zones uh, to be able to defend you know, stuff like this quick out to the tight end. That quick out to the tight end, I have to say, is probably one of the most important routes to understand and to truly work well with in this formation. So when they start to kind of fix their coverage and you start to notice that they're consistently fixing their coverage and they're kind of hanging on the running back, what I like to do is I'll go ahead and block the running back. And now, again, like I said, this is going to create more time for us, um, you know, maybe do a pass protection like this. And then as you can see now, we have more time to hit our slant or our post over the middle of the field. Um, you know, but then, like I said, they're going to have to drop zones. So they're going to have to have maybe this guy in a zone. They're going to have to have, um, you know, this guy manned up on the running back. And now their five-man pressure um, is going to become a four-man pressure. 
you know, and then something like this. And like I said, we're blocking this guy. So now we have a lot of time, or not a lot of time, but we have more time to be able to hit that slot post. And that slot post is one of the better routes in the formation. So if they're having to jet out there to guard, you know, the running back, and then they have to do something like this, that is going to start to leave vulnerabilities over the middle where we can then hit them with other routes um, in our arsenal, like this little motion streak or that right there, which is really the main reason you call this play is for that nice post route that does a really good job at beating man to man. So now their user has to kind of go over there to get that. And now they're starting to kind of get into a position where they're having to over adjust their coverage and they're having to use or something um, all out of a man play. So now that's going to leave vulnerability for this slant coming across the middle of the field to be hit right in that little pocket. This play can break down every coverage in the game. In our ebook, we teach you how to do that with this play. This play is so versatile. The U Trips formation as a whole just does such a good job at beating man coverage and being able to beat the blitz, which are the two main ways people are playing Madden 23 right now. So if you want to learn my entire U Trips offensive ebook, make sure you join our Patreon. It's only $10 to sign up for it. And like I said, it gets you access to all of our Madden 23 offensive and defensive ebooks. In addition to that, you'll also get access to all of the updates to those ebooks as long as your membership is active again it's only 10 bucks to sign up if you want to sign up head down to the description below and click the link to go join the patreon hopefully we'll see you guys over there